Okay, so um, let's go ahead and write the electron configuration for oxygen. Okay. So everybody go ahead and write it down while I'm looking for my pen. So oxygen is O, right, on the periodic table. So why don't you guys help me out in how I would write this electron configuration? 1s. Oh, yeah, go for it. 1s. 1s, 2. 2s, 2. And everybody else can help, too. 2p, 4. 2p, 4. Like that. Is everybody okay with that? Mm -hmm. Does that make sense to everybody? Look where it is on the periodic table. Okay, so if I were to have given you this, you should be able to tell me this, too, right? If I were to give you this or this, you should be able to tell me what the common ion of oxygen is. What's the common ion of oxygen? O2 minus, right? O2 minus. Like that, okay? So, what if I asked you, let's write the electron configuration for O2 minus. What would you say then? 1s2. Yeah, so help me out. 1s2. 2s2. 2s2. 2p6. Does everybody agree with that? Okay, so everybody's cool with that. What if I asked you to write the condensed electron configuration of oxygen? Could you guys do that? Yeah. So help me out. Let's helium. do it. What is it? He, helium. Helium. Is that it? 2 s 2 Like that? Yep. And what if I asked you to write the condensed electron configuration of O2 minus? What would it be? Helium. What would it be? Wait, no. It would be neon. Do you do the, ele the electron thing? That's it. Oh. Okay. That's the condensed electron configuration. Okay. So what if I asked, let's just do one more thing, since I know you guys know. Well. Let's, let's kill this video. Is there any questions on this? We'll do a video on quantum numbers now.